It seems like, especially lately, you younger guys seem to be a little more fashionable than a lot of the older guys that are in the league right now. Is, is that true? I mean, you obviously seem to be dressed pretty well and pretty cool. And like, well, if that... you look at me and Bo, and then you know we kind of separate ourselves from Joe. So, <laughs> Cali, that... Cali yeah. swag. It's a little bit uh... average Cali swag yeah, compared think... to the good Canadian right. type of actual fashion. It's understandable, but <laughs> I get it. Okay, that makes well. I mean, like, is this? Do you pick out your stuff before you? You know, the, like the night before, like, you know what, tomorrow's a big day. No. This is when I'm going to bust out. No, I got a, uh, uh, a person that does that for me. So oh, okay. so <laughs> this is all not That's me, all. but it works. So, <laughs> But you, like, you've got, you got a, a bit of a mix going on. you got the shorts, <laughs> flip-flops, hoodie. Can you explain is this, Yeah, just <laughs> describe your attire. I have horrific style, actually. I have... <laughs> I've worn a hoodie or a flannel every You've day this many summer. Years to yeah. fix it up, but no, no. I don't know. No, and I wore the same suit every game last year. It just, I had to change something up, so I went and bought a three hundred dollars suits right before I came out here, and uh, okay, I think that's about it. You know, see, the key is we, tried, we, we went to a, a Twilight premiere um, two years ago when we were getting drafted, and uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, why? Just, just. Oh no, no, like, we were at a, a Twilight premiere. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know. Right yeah, I, I understood that, but like, were you? Super oh, fan. So, yeah, I was gonna say yeah, like, you guys are all into that. You. Oh no, 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 yeah, we we're just a fan of the movie. Just, <laughs> okay. he's a fan. He was a fan of Bella, and <laughs> right. Uh, right. you know, right. so yeah, we camped out the night before. Anyway, um, <laughs> we were all wearing suits, and this guy comes in in an Adidas track suit. So that kind of uh, class how this you know guy rolls over here. Right. Athletic. That's what I said. That's athletic style. Oh, being gross style. <laughs> Having gross style. See, the key is if you got the, if you get the one suit or the two, you gotta change up the tie a little bit, change up the color of the shirt. This way, everybody kind of gets the illusion that it's a different wardrobe it's a completely different getup i don't i don't see it that way i i don't i feel like no one like takes notice on what you're wearing like that much like last year i had spilt strawberry jam Speak for yourself hey get off my case <laughs> go on with the story where you <laughs> i spilled strawberry jam on my jacket like first weekend and i just never took it to the dry cleaners and it just it just got worse and worse all year long and my mom said that something needs to change going forward. You're gonna, you're gonna get cut if you if you go on like this. Did it, did it start smelling? Oh no, like, it smelled good. It right. smelled good. Right, strawberry jam. Yeah, that makes sense. No, I'm a tie but, man. I got a lot of ties. Yeah. I like my ties, but I mean, I guess no one pays attention to that stuff anymore. So I may as well wear an Adidas track suit to games and <laughs> I don't know, athletic shorts and sandals. That's okay. Well, I mean, look. It works for him. He's. I mean, more girls talk to him than they do to me, but it's got to be because it's close. <laughs> well, there, there, see. Any girls? He's got than zero girls. <laughs> so. <laughs> so, so obviously, obviously the chirping is like you guys are well equipped in that in that kind of area of the game. What's what's been your favorite? Like, what's your go-to? Is there is there one that you kind of give all the time? Like, you can mix it up a little bit, but. I mean, like, not an appropriate one that we could say on camera, but <laughs> right. I mean, there's really no appropriate. There's, is, yeah. I was gonna say, there's, is there? There's no for camera, right? That's yeah. for sure. Yeah. You got to get on a, a real late night television show to get your actual, you know, spit your game, for right. sure. But all right, Kyle, turn around. <laughs> Just literally turn around. All right. All right. Let's see. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> that's a good one. Oh, we don't talk about that one. Uh, all right, so you guys are, you know, you're here. You got in over the weekend. Now, everybody's 19 and up. Is that is that the game? Yeah. Everybody's 19 and up. So have you experienced some of the extracurriculars that Toronto has to offer yet, or are you guys just here on a professional basis? Um, I think uh, maybe tonight. I mean, if the weather's right and things do fall into place, we may may make an appearance at some places, but... Right. Like Jack Astor's or... <laughs> How do, I know. Jack <laughs> <laughs> we've, been, we've been wondering what the places to be are at, so uh, we've just been asking yeah, maybe everyone. Maybe give us some insight on, yeah. on where to, where to I go can, tonight. I can... Jack Astor's is a restaurant. Okay. okay. Um, so you want to start there. 
Because, oh, okay. yeah. you know, there's some people that work at these establishments that, you know, they're, they may want to join you later. I don't know. Yeah. That, right. that happens occasionally. Is it open at 3 o'clock? In the afternoon? Yeah. Yeah, that's okay. All right. Hit up lunch, do what you got to do. See, I like it okay. because you, you can never count your chickens. So he's got the right game plan. You go in early. I got my ducks in a line for yeah, sure. See? You got, okay. it's, chicken, yeah. it's not ducks, it's chickens. <laughs> ducks in a line. It's because he played for the ducks. I got my penguins in a line. <laughs> You're getting cocky right now. <laughs> You're getting cocky on us. <laughs> See, this is what happens as as things progress, as things you know move along, the the attire changes up, the the chirping gets a little better. That was really a good, and then and then you start learning a few more things about going to restaurants at three o'clock, for whatever the reason, and and <laughs> you know what, maybe later on you have a better time at night. Exactly. No, you uh, put it pretty well right there. I like it. And we're we're going to continue this conversation off camera, um, and. If you watch TMZ, you may see these guys on there tomorrow morning. I'm just saying. Thanks, boys. All right. Thank you.